find someone new Baby, but you know I never will No So I choke you down just like a Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well and today I'm back again with another makeup tutorial and this is obviously on the look that I'm wearing right now and while doing this makeup tutorial I just remember that I kind of did a similar look a few months back and that was the grunge lamp makeup tutorial but it was not a halo eye. I did a halo eye and kind of used the similar products that I used in that video. I just remember that while doing the makeup. So. This is the look and if you guys want to see how I did this one, let's move on to the tutorial. I'm starting out with my base makeup and my face is really dry. I just washed it right now and it's not moisturized at all and it's winter. So my skin is getting flakier every day. So I'm going to be using my bio oil to hydrate and moisturize my face. And then I'm going to be applying my Makeup Revolution Aqua Priming Base on my face. Today I'm actually going to be trying out this brush set from mymakerperson.com and this is the Artist Do brush set which is the oval one and I'm going to be trying out these brushes today and I've already used this one in one of my previous videos but I'm going to be trying them out. I will try to use them uh, like in everything I do so hopefully it will go good and let's see how they work and for foundation today I'm going to be using my L'Oreal True Match foundation in the shade W7. Now for concealing my dark circles and also for highlighting my face now I'm going to be using my MAC Pro Long Wear Concealer in the shade NC35. Just for the sake of using these brushes today, I'm going to be trying cream contouring, which I really do. I actually don't feel comfortable with cream contour type of thing or bronzing up my face with any cream product. But I'm going to be using the Elegrel Pro HD Concealer in the shade Toast to bronze up my face or give it a bit of warmth back. Uh, so let's try it. And for setting my face today, I'm going to be using the Alex Avian Terracotta Powder. I'm starting off my eye makeup with my sleek Ultra Matte V2 Eyeshadow Palette and from this one, I'm going to be picking up the shade Maple. So I'm concentrating the color in the crease and also diffusing it in like the transition area so that it will be visible. Now I'm using the Alex Avian eyeshadow base in the shade black. Say 
And now I'm going to be picking up this eyeshadow from the same palette and this is in the shade Neuer and I'm going to be applying it on top of the base that I applied just now. Now I'm taking the Makeup Revolution Foil Eyeshadow in the shade Pure Platinum and I'm going to be applying it in the middle portion of my eyelid to create a halo eye makeup. For highlighting my inner corner and my brow bone, I'm going to be using this highlighter from the Sleek Solstice Highlighter Palette and this is in the shade Equinox. For eyeliner today, I'm going to be using this Rimmel Exaggerate Eyeliner in the shade Black. Done with my eye makeup and now I'm going to be bronzing up my face with my MAC Give Me Sun Bronzer. And as usual for contouring, I'm going to be using my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. For blush today, I'm going to be using my sleek blush in the shade Sahara. And for highlighting my face today, I'm going to be using my recent favorite highlighter and that is the sleek Cleo Petroski's highlighter palette. And from this one, I'm going to be picking up this golden color from here and this is in the shade Sphinx. I've already lined my lips with a brown lip liner and for lip color today I'm going to be using my Huda Beauty lipstick in the shade Trendsetter. So this is the final look after finishing the rest of my makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed this one and learned something new from this video. And I want to say about the oval brush set that I used to do my face makeup from mymakeupbrushset.com. I would likely go for them um, occasionally, but I would use the foundation brush regularly. I can say that much, but because I love the foundation brush, it blends my foundation really nicely. So you can check them out. I will give the link in the description box below of mymakeupbrush.com, and also I will be giving all the product lists down in the description box below. Please don't forget to check that out. And if you guys still haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do subscribe. And don't forget to follow me in my Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and also in Snapchat. And I hope to see you guys again in my next video. Till then, you guys take care. Bye-bye. YouTube channel, please do subscribe. And I will give all the product link in the description box below. Please don't forget to check them out. And if you guys still haven't subscribed, you will see me.